We're attempting to develop forecasts for about 500 million store item combinations every week, stretching out over a 52-week horizon for each week of those 52 weeks. And as you can imagine, that's a really big forecasting problem. But we actually have a fairly tight time window to be able to develop all those forecasts. So on Tuesday, we collect our data. We will go through a long feature engineering process to build out the features that are going to be consumed by our machine learning algorithms. After we've built out the features, we're going to take those features, run them through the machine learning algorithms, and develop model objects. And on Saturday, we have about a 12-hour window to build those features, develop the forecast, and push the forecast to the downstream system. So throughout this entire process, we're extremely constrained on time. And the problem is only going to get bigger as Walmart itself gets bigger and holds more store item combinations. The GPU acceleration we're seeing in the case of random forest and in the case of gradient boosting machines is on the order of 100 to 1. So you can imagine that really enables you to do a lot that you simply would not be able to do otherwise. The superior technology enables us to generate better forecasts. With gradient boosting machines, we can find small scale effects such as an extra lift for Chayote squash sales in the Louisiana region in Thanksgiving that you could not do with something as generic and broad-based as a state-space model. So you need powerful algorithms that can detect that sort of local anomaly in sales patterns for a very small subset or even only one item out of the 100,000 we sell. And there's a great deal of computation required to do that, and GPU technology is what enables us to do those computations. So we've been really excited to work with NVIDIA's RAPIDS team on directing the development of RAPIDS and testing it out and we're looking to move our entire production pipeline into Rapids over the course of the next six months.